digital simulation and training really has come a long way. But what works for flight simulators and vehicle simulators simply doesn't work for dismounted soldiers. The biggest problem is that the display is one directional. We have these rich 3D environments, but the environments can't see the dismounted soldier. And if you're invisible in a simulation, well then you're really not taking part. At Organic Motion, we're changing that. We are turning the display into a window. You can see the world and the world can see you and you can interact naturally in a 3D environment. At Organic Motion, we have developed various systems capable of tracking everything from the detailed movements of individual soldiers up to the ability to track a complete squad in an urban training environment. These realistic training simulations and applications prepare warfighters by immersing them in a virtual battlefield and equipping them with valuable skills they will need to stay safe when in harm's way. I advise I still have guns and uh, one fire team on that north south flank camp. I got you guys suppression, go, go, go! Well, the hard part is you're killing your enemy, it's finding. We don't know the boundary yet of where civilians live and work and where the Taliban are. I'm not gonna lie, I got caught up in the heat of the moment a lot of times. It certainly felt like I was back in theater, back running my squad like I did my last deployment. So I could hear sounds, trucks, bullets, uh, people talking. I could run around. I could pick up binoculars and scan. Northwest, Northwest 300 meters. I wouldn't really necessarily call it a video game. It was more of a training tool. It really did relate to what happened over there. 